Dada go bye bye. Say bye bye, Dada. You say bye. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. So today is kind of a busy day. I have a couple of fun things planned for Lucas and some places I need to take care of some errands and get to. Uh, to start off, I get to schedule our ultrasound for, I think, 20 weeks. And then I gotta get to the post office and pick up some stamps and get these in the mail. I wanted to swing by the store. This doTERRA catalog has a Play-Doh recipe in it that I've been wanting to make for half a year now or so. I think Lucas is getting to a little better age for it and I need to get some cream of tartar so I wanted to do that. And then he's starting to grow out of a lot of his clothes so I'm going to sit down and go through them and then get to our day and all these things I want to take care of. But first, I'm going to make this call. For scheduling and insurance authorizations, please press 1. I'm calling because I need to get an appointment scheduled for our 20-week ultrasound. Alright, so that is set for October the 26th in the morning. And Lucas brought me his books, reminding me, we're going to take these back to the library today, buddy? Okay, let's go like this. <gasps> so really a lot of these clothes are not organized because Lucas comes in here and gets in them and does his own organization. forget to take the recycling today. Can we check the P.O. box? Let's go. Come on. Can we take your books back? Come on. This way. the book. Jamberry <laughs> and snow truck. Alright, let's go get them. <laughs> 
All right, you guys, so we made it to the store and Lucas is going to get his very first balloon. Every time we come, he points at them and says balloon and it is officially time to get him one. So we are gonna pick one out. Lukey, where are the balloons? Oh, where are the balloons? Do you wanna get a balloon? Yeah, you wanna get a balloon, buddy? They just put a whole bunch more out for the holiday, but he really liked these bright colored ones over here. Should we get a balloon, buddy? Get a balloon, huh? I really like the sunflowers over here. Especially since we had so many growing in our yard this year. We have a whole bunch at all the checkouts. And then they have some down this aisle. Moana. Winnie the Pooh is cute. Found the cream of tartar. Mm -hmm. Some of these. You want to get a balloon? Can you say balloon? Are you going to pop that thing before the day is over? Oh no. You show Dada what you got today? Yeah! Oh, you're making him get him. You see balloon? Whoa. Wow. Weapon. Wild fish. So Micah made it home, obviously, and we discovered something out here when he got here, and I have to show you. Ooh. I heard a crazy noise when I was putting Lucas down for his nap, and it was some car taking out our mailboxes. Whoops. So the neighbor lady came and told me about it, and... The lady that was behind the guy that did it got his number and license plate and stopped and let them know. So we're gonna get new mailboxes. <laughs> we came to the park just outside of town. I wanted to come here earlier when Lucas woke up from his nap, but he took a pretty late nap this afternoon, so we got to come when Michael was home. Yay. There is a little waterfall here, and we're hoping to be able to see how much water is going over it. It's kind of hard to see, but we'll see what we can see. Falling in love 
walking to the edge. Waterfall is up that way. Climbing down there just is, I'm afraid of heights. So. I keep my boundaries from the edge, that's for sure. We love this little park and are so thankful it's so close by. It's neat to see Lucas get a play in some leaves. But we are hungry and it's time to get to our dinner. Falling in love is wonderful. This boy, we buy him a balloon. And he's over here reading his new books from the library. Boo! Boo. What do you got there? Uh. Are you reading? Uh. Want mama to read it? It's in my lap. Can you read books? This little guy. <laughs> you want to sit and read books? You got to turn around. Say bye. Dinner was really good. We're going to read some books and get ready for bed. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> so proud of myself right now. I just pulled all these clothes out of the closet to take to the women's shelter. Probably could have gotten like twice as much stuff out, but I wanted to give myself a chance to still wear some of the stuff. But some things are just extremely overworn. Some things I never even wore. And some things like this are really hard to let go of. I loved this camo skirt. Micah hated it. Wore it all the time. These, not so hard. I'm tired of wearing them and people seeing me in them. A suit that I had for real estate that I'll never need now. Having to sort through. This little guy's clothes inspired me to go through my own. I thought I'd probably get one box. You're noisy, but it looks like I got four. 